everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to share with you this super cute and easy DIY to make these adorable spring place card holders for your spring tablescape. And stay tuned for my next video because I will show you how I use these really cute place card holders on my spring tablescape. Before we get into the video, if you're new here, my name is Kirsty and welcome to my little community. If you haven't already, I would love if you could hit that subscribe button down below. That way my weekly videos should pop up in your YouTube subscription feed. Here's what you'll need to make this project. First off, a hot glue gun and some extra glue sticks. Mini eggs, mine are around three quarters of an inch or less. Two inch clay pots. These I picked up from Michael's and they were around 80 cents each. A couple of styrofoam balls. These fit inside the clay pot and that's very important. A paint or chalk pen. Some mini blackboards. Mine are on pegs, but I will actually be removing that. A faux tulip or any other kind of flower you'd like to use. I picked this one up from Kirkland's. Some moss. We'll use this to cover the styrofoam balls. You'll also want a pair of scissors and also a pair of wire or floral cutters. So the first step is to cut the styrofoam balls in half. I believe mine are around one and a half inches to fit in the two inch pot that I have. I just use a serrated knife to do this, but you could also use a utility knife. And you can see here that they just fit perfectly inside my little clay pots. Next, trim the stem on your faux floral to length. For this particular tulip I used, I needed to remove the leaves because they went too far down on the stem. And then I actually re-hot glued them further up the stem to allow about half an inch to fit through the styrofoam ball. Once completed, I just made a small hole in the styrofoam with a screwdriver and inserted the tulip into it and it actually stayed just fine without hot gluing it in place. Now to hide all of that styrofoam I'm adding some hot glue on top and then I'm going to just stick moss down all over the styrofoam to cover it up and right up to the bottom of the tulip stem just like this. Now the mini blackboards I chose had little pegs on the back so I just removed half of the peg and the little wire bit that keeps them in place. And then I wrote the name of each of the people at my table setting on to the blackboards in cursive with my paint pen. Then all I needed to do was add some hot glue to the back of the remaining portion of the peg and stick it into my pot. I actually stuck it onto the side of the tulip like this and I found that held it in place very well. Next, we're gonna add the mini eggs in around the base of the name tag and pot. So here I'm just figuring out where I want the eggs to go, adding a little hot glue and then sticking them in place. I used all three eggs in this pot. You've probably noticed that I never hot glued that styrofoam ball in place inside the pot. And I actually found that all of this stayed in place perfectly fine without doing that. And I really like that that means that I can pull all of this out, disassemble it and reuse all of the parts, especially the little clay pot for another project. So I hope you enjoyed seeing how I made these adorable little place card holders. If you did, I would love if you could give me a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button down below if you haven't already. Don't forget, stay tuned for my next video because I will show you how I use these. Thanks for watching, happy spring decorating, and I will see you all soon. Bye.